Toronto City Council has made it official. It says the city is in a climate emergency. Just the path environment activists like Emmy Ma were hoping the city would choose. So the motion has applying a climate lens to major decisions, including funding decisions for the city. Council will now adopt stronger emissions reduction targets with the goal of becoming a net neutral city by 2050. I'm uh, elated that we have, uh, have unanimous support. I'm going to remind councillors of this every time that we have a request come back from uh, from staff that we need more investment in these initiatives. Mayor John Tory hopes a new effort called the Green Will Initiative will help make progress on the matter. It includes new measures to help target the city's biggest greenhouse gas emitters, buildings. The participants will work with the city to continuously reduce their footprint, leveraging the experience of the city and other partners in finding new ways to reduce energy usage. Tory says 10 groups representing landowners across the city have signed on. Collectively, they represent more than 300 million square feet of space across the city. In perspective, the Toronto Eden Centre is about 1.7 million square feet. So imagine about 176 Eden Centres of space across the city taking part in the program. Tory's plan doesn't come with a price tag and the same goes for the city council motion on expanded emissions targets. The city's chief financial officer is saying those numbers won't be known until the next budget process in 2020. Matthew Bingley, Global News.